Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for September 30th, 2021. If you have not gone and looked at the weekly, please make sure that you do that as well. There is a lot of important information there. And of course, as always, if you want to uh, come and see what's going on for your particular situation and you want a personal reading, just go to angelsouls444.com. I do Akashic readings as well now. Uh, just make sure you note that. You won't see that as an option. Just note it in your submission form. And do stay tuned. Make sure you're subscribed because I will be, I don't know when I'll be able to get it done. I'm going to try to film it soon <laughs> and get it all edited and, and up there. So I will make an announcement. Make sure that you are getting notifications. So you got to hit that notification bell as well. Here we go. Surrender to the divine full moon. Stuff is, it's right there in our face. It's coming to a culmination. We cannot accept the unacceptable. And there's so much of it. And a lot of people are coming forward who have been overlooked. Um, you know, one of the big things is, okay, you know, why are we focusing on this story out in the news when there have been so many stories like that? It just wasn't for white people. And, and those get overlooked, you know, and that's not to diminish what's happening to that family. You know what I'm talking about, what news story. It's not to diminish their pain whatsoever. But, you know, we are having to look at the broken parts of us the parts that need to be mended. And let's not get self-righteous and say, well, I'm not broken. That's not very spiritual. That's not very love and light. You're being negative by saying we're broken. Well, there you go. That's the point I've been trying to make. How people will you know, just kind of swoop around what's really going on because it's unpleasant. We're going to be seeing more and more that we don't have room for that anymore. Okay, so there is a sense here of surrendering to the divine because whatever comes up, I'm not saying that it needs to be overwhelming. It doesn't have to be. Don't let it get overwhelming for yourself if you can, you know, manage that a little bit, cope with that a little bit better. Again, check with an expert with, you know, how your brain works and all of that. But as far as like the spiritual practice behind it, we need this self awareness and the things that come up you may not like okay and that's all right because again it's all a part of the process another thing that they're coming in here and saying you know we we need to sort of unlock ourselves from this idea that success looks like this this and this or as far as relationships go you need to be married and be doing this this and this when really sometimes people have to take a, a beat and a moment to heal because our biggest purpose here is to develop on a soul level and to help humanity. That's why we showed up, okay? So some people even showed up as the antagonist. That's a weird thing to think of, right? Some people showed up as the antagonist. Why? The contrast. If we're not aware of what needs to be fixed, if it's not up in our face, we just come and just go, la, 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 look at the pretty trees, and then we don't do anything, <laughs> right? So in a weird way, we all have a purpose here, Let's not squander this opportunity and get off path by trying to hide from what we came here to do. All right. We're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.